Hello, all. Shoestring here. In one of my previous videos, I've shown how batteries can be wired in parallel. However, I've had several questions about wiring batteries in series. So today we're going to discuss wiring batteries in series, and we're going to demonstrate that. Okay? First, if you're wiring batteries together, regardless if it's series or parallel, you want them to have the same voltage and the same amp hours. This way they work efficiently together. So here I have two batteries. They're both 12 volts. They're AGM batteries, and they're 35 amp hours. I got both of these from Harbor Freight, if anyone's wondering. Now, what we want to do when we're doing series is we want to increase the voltage, but leave the amp hours alone. So, these are both 12 volts. When we're finished, it is going to be a 24 volt system. But the amp hours will still be 35 amp hours, even though they're connected together. Okay, now we're going to start out by taking our, taking our multimeter, turning it on, and making sure our batteries are fully charged. Please make sure... Before you put batteries in a bank, they are fully charged. Okay, that's 13. And we'll now let it sit for a minute go to the next one. And it is also, hopefully you can see that, 13. Okay, so fully charged batteries that are 12 volt, of course, will cho show 13 when you have them all the way charged up. All right, now to do this in series. You're going to take the positive and you're going to connect it and you're going to connect it to the negative. Fairly simple. We're going to take, oh, this wire, by the way, which is four gauge, is longer than I would normally have it for these two batteries. You want it to be as short as possible so you don't lose very much power in the process. But I wanted to show you how we do it so I got a much longer cable so everyone can see real well. Also, you're going to want these to be tight when you get them on the battery. In this case, I'm just going to do finger tight because I'm just doing a demonstration. So, Positive, now to the negative. Okay, get that one on. Now, these are wired in series. So they're both going to stay at 35 amp hours, but we have increased the voltage to 24 volts. Let's show that on our multimeter, right? Going to do positive and negative. And it is at 26. That's because they were both charged up to 13. But it is now, as you can see, a 24-volt system. Okay, now I want to talk about charging. When you want to charge these batteries when they're in series, you want to make sure you charge them evenly. So when you have your charge controller or you have a battery charger, make sure you put connect the positive to the positive on one battery and then connect to the negative terminal on the other battery. This way, they will both charge up evenly, and it will keep them the same. So, important to remember, series, you're taking and you're connecting the positive to the negative, and you're also increasing the voltage from, in this case, 12 volts to 24 volts. But the amp hours stay the same. These two... 35 amp power batteries are still only going to be 35 amp hours. 
I also did another video on Parallel. Down in the description, I'll put down a link to it. So you can pull that up if you want to see how to wire it in parallel. Of course, if there's any questions, you have any comments, please put it down in the comment section. If you like videos like this, please like and subscribe. Shoestring out.